yes good morning students how are you all <coughs> uh, today we are going to talk about big data versus cloud computing big data versus cloud computing okay so our uh, today's topic is big data versus cloud computing okay big data and cloud computing are some of the important leading technologies which are used in today's scenario okay with the help of these technologies business education research healthcare and development etc are leading rapidly and will offer different advantages to enhance their areas with tricks and techniques so in the big data versus cloud computing we will study about the differences between big data and cloud computing okay so first of all uh, let's fo uh, let's focus that uh, what is big data the question is that what is big data okay <coughs> Big data is defined as a set of large data, structured or unstructured, that is used to collect information from it. Once again, big data is defined as a set of large data, structured or unstructured, that is used to collect information from it. In big data, there is a large amount of data produced by the companies in every second with which which needs to be processed so so big data will gather store and organize data which will be further analyzed by the data analysis so in other term in other way we can say that big data is the whose amount of data which can process valuable information valuable information what Big data is the whose amount of data which can process valuable information. Okay, guys. <clears throat> so now, what is cloud computing? What is cloud computing? Okay. <clears throat> cloud computing offers a virtual environment in which the information is gathered via the internet. This reduces the use of a physical server like mo most of the data can be stored in cloud separately in the cloud with the help of virtualization. The cloud also provides platforms that are used to share a computer competency for running programs. Okay, so uh, it is uh, a cloud computing. Now, big data versus cloud computing. First concept. Concept. In cloud computing, we can fetch and store the data from anywhere at any time means it is available 24-7, okay? In cloud computing, we can fetch and store the data from anywhere at any time means it is available 24-7. However, big data is the huge amount of data that will process to extract the important information, okay? Second, uh, next characteristics. Second characteristics okay characteristics in characteristics uh, cloud computing offers service over the internet which can be s software as a service we have already discussed Second, platform as a service. And third, infrastructure as a service. Okay. Whereas, on the other hand, the important characteristic of big data, big data are velocity, variety, and volume. Okay. Velocity, velocity, variety. And volume volume okay <clears throat> next accessibility
हाँ क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग ऑफर्स यूनिवर्सल एक्सेस टू सर्विसेस वट क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग ऑफर्स यूनिवर्सल एक्सेस टू सर्विसेज ओके हाउ ओवर बिग डेटा सोल्व टेक्निकल प्रॉब्लम एंड ऑफर बेट एंड ऑफर्स बेटर रिजल्ट ओके नेक्स्ट वेन टू यूज अ कस्टमर कैन मूव टू क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग वेन दे रिक्वायर रैपिड deployment and scaling of the applications the application deals with highly sensitive data and needs strict consent one should keep things on the cloud on the other hand big data solve a specific problem statement which is related to whose data sets and does not deal with small data sets okay next cost Cloud computing requires less maintenance cost due to the centralized platform, no upfront cost, no up, no upfront cost, and disaster safe implementation. However, big data is a robust. However, big data is a robust ecosystem, highly scalable and cost effective. Okay, next job roles, job roles, and responsibility. See. the developers and office workers in an organization are the users of the cloud whereas on the other hand in big data the data analysis is responsible for analyzing the data for analyzing the data and possible future trends okay next types and trends very important types and trends first public cloud second private cloud third hybrid cloud fourth we can mention community cloud okay community cloud first public cloud second private cloud third hybrid cloud and fourth community cloud so trends in big big data technology are hadoop if we talk about big data hadoop okay and uh, what we say uh, uh, map reduce what map reduce map reduce okay if you talk about types public private hybrid community in cloud computing okay and if you talk about big data hadoop map reduce etc next vendors vendors next vendors vendors are uh, in cloud computing vendors are amazon okay amazon web services web services AWS. We must have studied. Okay, Microsoft. Microsoft. Dell. Apple. IBM. Etc. Okay. If you talk about big data vendors, in big data Apache. Big data. apache and uh, map r and we can also include a cloud era etc okay next uh in tabular form okay let's see the difference between big data and cloud computing okay first big data big data and cloud computing cc okay see big data first point big data offers a way to manage a large volume of data and generates insights cloud computing on the other hand cloud computing offers resources like storage computing databases monitoring tools etc on demand okay second point is that big data is used to describe a large set of data and information cloud computing is used to store data and information on remote servers once again i explain big data is used to describe a large set of data and information 
cloud computing is used to store data information on remote servers third point is that it includes all types of data that are in different formats it's a new paradigm for computing resources fourth point is that big data is used to define a large volume of a large volume of data cloud computing is used to store data on remote servers okay data on remote servers so remote remote servers okay it is very important in cloud computing okay remote servers okay. huh. big data refers to data which can be structured semi structured or unstructured what big data Big data refers to the data which can be structured, semi-structured or, or unstructured. Cloud computing refers to internet service from software platform and independent. Software as in first uh, software as a service, platform as a service, okay, and infrastructure as a service. Okay. Once again, big data offers a way to manage a large volume of data and generates uh, insights. And on the other hand, cloud computing offers resources like storage, computing, databases, monitoring tools, etc. on demand. Second, big data is used to describe a large set of data and information. Cloud computing is used to store data and information on remote servers. Okay. Third thing is that it includes all types of data that are in different formats. It, it's a new paradigm for computing resources. <coughs> Big data is used to define a large volume of data. Cloud computing is used to store data on remote servers. Okay. Big data refers to data which can be structured, semi-structured or unstructured. And a cloud computing refers to internet service from software as a service, platform as a service, infrastructure as a service. Okay. So it was it was all about uh, big data and cloud computing. I hope you must have gotten all this. Thank you. Thank you very much.